Hi, and welcome back, you beautiful people, to Quantum Break. This is a new game that I got. Uh, just going to be trying this out. Um, I'm going to go with normal, because I don't feel like getting my ass handed to me and all that right off the bat. Just been trying to get all this set up, and what the fuck's going on here? Why is it all blue? Okay, something seems to be going on. There we go. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. That is awesome. Number one killer is time. The number one killer is time. It destroys us all. This is what you need to know. Time broke. A growing fracture leading to the end of time. We went after a device that could fix it. Things turned ugly. Paul Stream was there to stop us. He has superpowers. Jack. Him and me both. We failed. Jack. And of course, time travel was involved. Jack. Going too fast for you? Okay. What do you want to cover first? You tell me. Let's start at the beginning. Did they model Jack? When you first arrived at Riverport University. Sorry. Did they model Jack's character after an actual actor or something? I came back home to see my best friend, Paul Serene. He wanted to show me what he'd been working on. My brother, Will, was a scientist. He was also involved. Paul said it was world changing. He was right. Whoa! Come on! Watch where you're going, man! Fuck off! Get out of the road! I agree with them. Asshole. Riverport University. Here we are. Thanks for the ride. No problem. University looks like kind of shit. You might be holy crap. Oh. You'd been away for six years. Paul and I had kept in touch, but well, not so much. How did it make you feel? I was just happy to see Paul. <laughs> Rough night, huh? Oh, it's for um, I, it's just whatever's done not even matter anymore. I'm, I'm, yeah. Jesus Christ, dude. With that bottle of Jaeger. Oh. I guess I should go find Paul. Sweet. Join the protest. Okay, I thought that it said modest. Paul. Jack. Just got to the campus. Where are you? God, it's good to hear your voice. Uh, when you hit the courtyard, look right. You'll see this fancy modern physics building with the lights on. I'll meet you inside there. I am so looking forward to this, man. You still haven't told me what this is. I know. See you soon. Why 4 a.m.? Why not wait till morning? Paul had always been a showman. Hey you, take action now. Monarch Solutions wants to tear down the pride of Riverport University. Oh, pride. Not bad. <laughs> the beautiful and historic library building generations have studied it. This is a part of our heritage, but they don't care. Are you going to put it up with that? Of course you aren't. Uh, whatever. Job, job. Hey, do you know where the physics building is? You mean the big ass metallic turtle behind me? <laughs> Hard to miss, man. Thanks. Babe, can we go home yet? Hey, it's Bobby Radford here on the tail end of the night shift. How you doing, Riverport? Burning the midnight oil? Just waking up? Are you getting ready for bed? Or maybe you're 
And that looks like the top part of the code deck that he's on. Sorry about that. this every story finds its writer that's actual footage that's game what the fuck I can't tell what's real and what's not in this video Sounds awesome. And there's a person back there. Oh, Pepsi. Awesome. If you're with that fraternity, you've done enough damage. We're being shut down. <laughs> hey, I come in peace. I'm just meeting a friend nearby. At 4 a.m.? Yeah, tell me about it. Well, we're spreading awareness about Monarch Solutions, so if you want to know how badly they're giving us the shaft, then you could just ask me. All right, what's going on here? Okay. How would you feel if you knew a corporate monopoly was taking a massive dump all over your personal history? Your hair is freaking. Uh, that's quite an opener. Good. Because that beautiful library over there is over a hundred years old. It's part of the city's heritage. And Monarch Solutions plans to tear it down tomorrow. Do you want to know why? We've got a chart with all the details. Yeah. Protests seem like a lost cause. Maybe sympathize with the students. I know, I know, I need to get to the actual game, but objectives. 
I don't want to be any of its steps. Or rather, side objectives. Oh, you need something? Yes, you are. Stop on problems. Some protest. Stepping on the shiny object. Paul had always been hungry for success. Driven. He made it onto a lot of those top young professionals lists. And now he was coordinating some huge project at the university. It's a big deal for him. Hey, protest's over. At home. Now why I'm here, Chief. Holster that safety whistle. Prick. <laughs> okay, yeah. Smart ass character. Sound change. Motion blur in this video. In this game is actually You made awesome. a long trip just to see a research project? Well, reading between the lines, Paul was under a lot of pressure. <laughs> he needed a friend. I wanted to help him any way I could. Son of a bitch. Jack Joyce. In the flesh. The esteemed Mr. Paul Serene. What's shaking money bags? Shut up and bring it in. <laughs> Welcome home. It looks like it was based off the... Six years. Hold on. And I was starting to think you'd never come back. Yeah, me too. Come on. It looks like Paul's character model was based off of this way. Harrison Wells from Flash. We're going upstairs to the project lab. How was the flight? First class. Thank you for that. It's a step up from our van trip to Utah. I missed that van. I'm guessing that Will's not meeting us. He doesn't know we're here. I knew Paul had asked my brother Will to consult on his project. Will was all the family I had, but he was difficult. In here, Jack. Going up. There's more to this than you're letting on. Is it about my brother? I still worry about him, huh? If Will did something wrong, then- Jack, man. Look, I've been tight-lifted about this for a reason. This project we've been working on is going to change the entire world. Uh, why do I smell one of your long-winded presentations on the horizon? <laughs> I would never. <laughs> oh, look. <laughs> a perfectly placed presentation to illustrate the project. Now, who put that there? <laughs> oh, shocking. Okay. Enough joking. The lab's this way, Jack. Yeah, Come on. Come on. Let's just get to the big show. <laughs> you haven't changed at all. I didn't notice that it was an option. I should have gone with the sit down. Fucker. Thank you for tuning in, and remember, if you liked the video, please hit that like button, share, subscribe, it all helps, and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye!